makes this shit real I contemplate that how I feel But you make it way too hard to think Good morning guys, happy Saturday. My name is Amadee Katie. But anyway, as you can tell, you your girl didn't work. But I get off at 3 o'clock. And like I told y'all in my vlog, my Thanksgiving vlog, that um, I'll be going home to, back home, well, going to Tunga. Um, because the hair was, um, hello. The hair was, the hair was, um, family is having something today. So that's what I'll be doing when I get out work. And I will be vlogging that. So I'm trying to do, I'm trying to do better. I got the scar on my knee because I had, um, uh, sprayed my hair down with some rose water. And some, my, um, carrot oil shame. So I got this down for at the moment, but I'm gonna take it off in a minute. It should have been, you know, so fouled it up or whatever. But anyway, <clears throat> I just came on here to do the intro. As you can tell you, I ain't doing nothing but putting sensors on these um, shades at, at the moment. And then, um, yeah. <clears throat> Don't look like we're gonna be busy today. Because ain't nobody really just coming today. They might be doing either second Black Friday sale, um, shopping today or something like that. But um, yeah, so right now we're not busy. We do we do have people come in um, early on Saturdays, but not today. But I'm trying to see what we're gonna eat today. I'm gonna try not to eat too heavy because we have we eat. Even when I go to Tonka. So, yeah. But, um, anyway, I just came on here to say hello to y'all. And, um, I hope y'all having a good Saturday. And, thanks for all the love and the, um, the comments. So, I can't thank y'all enough, though. And thanks to, um, oh, I'm forgetting something. <laughs> I've been meant to um, give her a shout out back. I don't know if I did it or what or whatnot. But thanks to Platinum D, this was this who I was talking about, my favorite uh, YouTuber. Um, thanks for her. Uh, thanks to her, she gave me a shout out when I uh, saw her birthday gift or whatnot. Um, she actually shot me out twice. She shot me out when she opened the gift before she did the birthday haul. And then when she did the birthday haul, she gave me another shout out. And I saw, you know, some of her subscribers came over and let me know that they, um, that they came from Platinum D. I appreciate y'all for coming over and subscribing to my channel. Thank y'all. I can't thank y'all enough. I can't thank Platinum D enough, baby. She's... She's real down to earth and a good person at heart. So, yeah, I appreciate it that you gave me a shout out on your channel. And continue to stay blessed, like I, like I said. Continue to stay blessed and continue to keep that positive vibe that you have, sweetheart. But anyway, I ain't gonna hold the intro long, but I'm gonna go. I see you guys like in the midst of me doing something else. <laughs> okay. Y'all, it just started picking up. I ain't fucking ready to go on. I got from like almost hours. <laughs> last hour, last hour of the day for me, baby. She gonna check me. Nobody. But yo, I ain't doing nothing. But uh, I'll be back. So I done made it to Tunica, y'all. So I I I know they got music playing. So we at the little president building in Tunica. I'm finna get my little girl up on and show y'all. I don't know. I ain't really that home around, but I'm finna go enjoy my family and y'all will see some clips here and there. Inside the building. Okay. Hello. 
Wait, who, who about a... Uh, 2014? Who, who about a screen... Oh, no, not screen, but a camera cover. <laughs>
And really, that was the last time that, you know, my dad was there. That was the last uh, uh, family he was there. But like I said, we, we got to keep this love together and keep our family together and stay together. Because without love, we ain't got nothing. Family is all we got. So we go today, we, we're going to give everybody a chance that, you know, have this suggestion of what they, uh, where y'all want to go. So, I don't know if they're going to pass what's We're going to do that later. <laughs> we'll let one take over. They something serious. <laughs> hey, everybody, how y'all doing? I'm <laughs> Oh, okay then. How everybody doing? Hey y'all! Hey. Happy belated Thanksgiving! It's good to see everybody. Bless the Lord, hallelujah. Hey, Amen. Hell. It's good to have our oldest uncle here, our Uncle CL, and our oldest auntie. Oh, no, no, no. to bless the Lord, hallelujah. Come on, y'all. It's like y'all happy for that. Amen. Amen. Yay. I mean, uh, I just want to say that um, it's been a while since we had a family reunion, like he said, it's been because of COVID. But um, we know a lot of us are saved. We know a lot of us aren't saved. But don't allow you not living for Christ to keep you from your family because you're worried about being judged, because that ain't what we do. We show love on this side, so if we go somewhere, we want everybody to go. We don't want it to always be somewhere where we got to go meet at a church or be at a funeral to see each other. So we just need to do better and come back to, as a family, as grandma and granddaddy always kept us. I remember being at grandma and granddaddy's house, everybody sleeping on the floor. Made a pattern for everybody. We have a three bedroom. And I don't know how she kept all them grandchildren. 30 children in one house. But she fed everybody. And y'all know it. She'll tell you, baby, she might not have but a drop left. PJ, no. Finn said, what you got there, grandma? She said, come on by here and just get you something. Don't ain't thin to PJ. And she bring the cheer. So that's the kind of love that we should have for each other. Even she fed Ricky. That's how I adopted Uncle right there. She fed Ricky. You know, so we were glad to see him. So that's the way we should be to one another. It's time for us to come together. I mean, our legacy is gone on. We done lost grandma, we done lost granddaddy, but we still here. To love on each other, just like Sonny said in the prayer, it's time for us to come together and be better with each other. Because a lot of our kids don't know each other like we did when we was growing up. You know, we were more of sisters and brothers when we were growing up, more than cousins. You know, one fight, I will fight. You know, we might tear down the block. You know, but hey, nobody knew not to mess with us because the hair game was coming, baby. You know, but I thank God for it. But that ain't all we were known for. Our grandparents were known for taking care of the neighborhood. So a lot of people loved us for who we were related to. So it's good to be related to good people because that carries on a good name. You know, so I thank God for that. Like everywhere I go, most people know Pastor Harris. So I get a lot of respect in places that I go to because of Pastor Harris or people know Uncle Clarence. Even though he clown, people love him. You know, he might cut a shine, but people love him. You know, they know Dr. Willis. You know, I thank God for that. They know my mama. I'm telling y'all, Uncle Clarence put up an exit lock and they said I should be a child. I believe they gave my mama the wrong baby sometimes. But that's all right. That, that's my uncle, he know it. But he ain't my favorite, though. That was my favorite back there. Wave your hand. Daddy, uncle, wave your hand. Don't be shy. Let everybody know I belong to you, him. Y'all yeah. see him wave the hand. Try to wave a hand real low. He know I'm heels. <laughs> but anyway, we just here to show love. I thank God. We got some other aunties and uncles and stuff. Uncle Simon and Aunt, Aunt uh, uh, Lou ain't moved and calm today. Now they say I ain't like her too, she clown too. And uh, Uncle, Uncle Jesse, he ain't here. But I thank God that we have an extended family that we, we love each other. Amen. So we, we came together today. Let this not be the last time. Y'all know I need to. She got to say something. <laughs> yeah, this is spokesperson of the family. Y'all know that. Hello, everyone. Hello. I'm glad to see you all came out. Show some love. You know, uh, I was I just had to come up here because I was trying to get them to get started on their own. Because you got to realize that one day we're going to be going off the scene. 
And a lot of times, you know what we'll say is, well, Sorry, grandmama gone. You know, we say that in the family. Grandmama gone, so the family gone. Mm -hmm. Really? I beg the difference. <laughs> you know, the reason the family gone, because we don't want to do anything. No. So that's why I'm up here. We got to come together. You know, we are fall out by this smallest little thing, but don't mean nothing. Because when you have a family, I mean, you got to put your different sides. We gon' we gon' agree to disagree. Still get along. Still get along. There's my brother Melvin and my oldest brother here. My brother uh, Clay is sitting there. I got sisters over here. Sisters, brother over there. My Arthur, Sam, and all those. You know, we we're the old old clans, as you would say. So if you all are the next generation. In order to carry something on, you got to start somewhere. So that's why we're trying to pass this torch on to them. So someone else can help out. You know, we always say, well, y'all just do it. They get tired sometimes. Rod get tired when somebody calls them all the time to cook. Come on now. We don't want to come sit down. We want to sit down too. You see what I'm saying? This ain't about that family. You better not come sit down. You do that with guests. Ain't nobody in here a guest. Everybody in your family. When we need something done, you need to just jump up and do it. We shouldn't have to ask you to clean up. There's too many, too many families. I, I sit and I watch too many families just whack three or four people out. That's all you want to do is come sit and enjoy. Then you want to talk, you want to bash, you want to throw your shades, what didn't go right and this and Well, what did you did? What did you contribute? What did you do? You see what I'm saying? I'm not bashing you. I'm just letting us know. We said we saved and all this here, but we can't get together. That's a family down here. On, we have to understand, salvation is not our whole lifestyle. Mm -hmm. We still have a, 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 a earthly family here mm -hmm. that we have to kind of come together, just like uh, it was first stated. We have to come together to understand that may be somebody in the family about to take their life. We don't know because we don't communicate with nobody. We just go to our own and me and the family, the family that we may have, a husband and a wife and our children, and that's it. That is not the way God designed this thing to be. Your family branch out. It branch out. So we got to come together and realize that. Just a phone call, all you got to do sometimes. You can send a text. That's all we young group do now is send texts out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, if somebody needs something, they may ask for a uh, Forty dollars, you know. You ain't got to tell everybody that's in the family because Sally needs forty dollars now. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? They may be in a dire need of that forty dollars, but you don't need to be on that phone trying to tell everybody else. Yeah. That's what a family about. See, like I say, when when I tell people all the time, my daddy gone on. I'm glad my salvation wasn't in my dad. You see what I'm saying? Because I wouldn't be able to make it. Mm -hmm. My mom gone on, but my salvation was not in my mom. You see what I'm saying? My brother Robert gone on, but I'm still here. Because we are all here for a purpose. God placed every last one of us here for a purpose. You see what I'm saying? So it's time for us to get about doing what God wants us to do. Like I said, we can disagree. We can agree to disagree or disagree to agree. Because you just go on home. You don't need to be arguing all, all day long. Just go on home and leave it alone. So you know what? I'm going to put a pen right there. We're going to leave that alone. <laughs> Because sometimes when stuff get in my spirit, people go to talk about, you know what? I don't want to hear no more. Because it's in your spirit too deep, then you need to leave it alone. So we ain't going to keep talking though, but it's time for us to just come together more and more and, and uh, understand what is going on with our family. Just, we all on Facebook just about. Everybody in here just about on Facebook. But some people ain't going to come in on nothing. But every, they want everybody to come in on their staff. Did you see that thing I sent you over there? Well, did you see mine? You see what I'm saying? Come on now, we got to do better. We got to do better. It's not about me. It's not about them. It's not about you. But God has blessed us to be here to enjoy one another. And I pray that we all get to <laughs> <laughs> Hey, sister. <laughs> 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 <la
This is the person that didn't want to give me an extra tomato. I know you didn't. Yeah. You need one tomato. Two tomato, ain't you? Really? You want, look what they take you and she put on there. Yeah. <laughs> It's a cry. <laughs> My, this stuff is cold out. This was not supposed to be a top on that. I know that you're a top on that. Uh -uh, I wasn't in on them. I just put mine on the side because I ain't want the trees. I would, if I didn't see it, it's a whole lot, huh? We're cleaning up for the night, y'all.